Hey how's it guys, this is Coach from Savage Gaming and today we've got a brand new video um, on the Aquala emblem. Uh, this one's a requested emblem and basically, you know, I'm gonna make it for you today. Um, first off, uh, I don't know whether it's gonna be it's gonna be optional or not, you can start with a white background, but um, today I'm not gonna start with a white background since um, it's not really it's not like too um, needy at this point in time. Um, okay, first we're gonna start off the gold flag. Um, we're going to flip it over and we're going to uh, basically just make it go a bit wonky like that. Um, we're going to have it just go across the screen or across the emblem just like that. So the top bit is just at the edge of the left hand side and the bottom bit is just about in the middle. Uh, now the koala is actually a cartoon or as koala. Um, I actually searched for it myself and basically this one is an easy koala to make so it shan't be too hard. Um, it's mostly made up of circles, so, you know, simple as. Um, actually, no, before we go into that, let's make the circle smaller and make sure the wood... This is going to be the wood bit and make it like a sort of brownish. You know, make it how you want it to be made. Okay, we're going to get it to circle. We're going to distort it a bit. A bit slightly like that. Um, make it a sort of lightish grey colour. Possibly that sort of grey colour. And uh, now we're just going to push it down here. Not too high up, otherwise I'm not too big either, because we want the koala to actually be able to fit on the screen. Otherwise it won't fit. Uh, tilt it slightly, so it's basically just pointing up towards, uh, with the branch, in other words. And then we're going to leave it like that. Now we're going to copy and paste it, and we're going to just sort of change the colour, so it's a bit more brighter. Uh, now we're going to tilt it even further, and have it more generally pointing higher at the branch. And just make it just make it go with the groove there, and that should be fine. Uh, now for the last bits, we're just gonna copy paste it. Um, we're just gonna make it a bit smaller, and that should be the foot. Um, perhaps make this a bit more tilted towards the tree, and that should be it. Uh, gonna go to layer five, and this one's gonna be where the arm is. Um, I'm not too sure what I actually used for the arm. I think I used the quarter circle. Um, made it the same colour as the other pieces. Don't know if that's the same colour or not. Yeah, it's the same colour. Uh, I'm going to basically stretch it as much, like use it as much as we can. So, that, nah, not that. That would be useful. Make it as large as you can. Thick as possible. Okay, that should be it. Uh, now we're going to copy and paste these circles from layer 4. I'm just going to join them up with the arm. Copy and paste that and join up the other piece of the arm. And that's journey for a bit. Now we're going to get the circle again. Uh, perhaps, perhaps copy and paste layer 8 and just make it a bit larger here. I don't know why they designed the head like this. Basically, the koala is smiling, so um, should be good. Um, but it's just gonna make it like a sort of squarish circle, and that should be it. Uh, copy and paste it. Put it below the layer and make it white. Uh, make it a bit smaller, a bit over. Copy and paste that to layer eleven. Push it down to layer ten. Past. Which is underneath the face. Do the same thing there. And that's the ears generally shaped out correctly. Uh, now we've got to um, generally start on making the ears look more better. Um, we're going to use the swoop to do this. We're going to make it the same colour as the leg and arm. I'm going to make it a lot smaller. Now we're just going to shape it like that. And just curve it with the ear and that will do we copy and paste it and flip it and do the same for this ear and that's good um, no don't copy and paste it but uh, we're gonna make the uh, ears much more detailed um, 
In this picture, we have a few little extra lines and the ears. But apart from that, um, the ears will be done. Uh, we're going to use a certain shape here. I don't know what shape it was. Um, it's not half shuriken. It's definitely not half shuriken. I literally forgot the shape. Yeah, I literally forgot the shape. I'll give that to you. Ah, it's called the uh, kiss, which is kind of weird. It's not a really good shape for a kiss. Anyway, we're going to make it the same color as the leg and arm and everything else. Then we're just going to push it right in. Make it very tiny. And just push it along the ear like that. Go and paste it. Do this about three times around the ear. And that should be it for that ear. Now do it again for this ear. Go and paste it again. And one more time, and that's it. Now we've got the um, nose to do here. Let's do the nose first. Uh, we're going to get a basic circle and make it black. Um, put it directly in the middle, whatever suits you as the middle. That'll suit me as the middle, so I'll distort it a bit, make it a bit wider like that. And that should be it for that bit. I'll copy and paste it. Uh, go to layer 20, which is below the no, the blown nose. Uh, just push it down a bit. For some reason it looks off. I don't know why. Maybe I'll push it a bit further. Okay, that's going to be the white bit's going to be the small sort of thing. Um, we're going to copy and paste the. No, not copy and paste. We're going to get another circle. Make that very tiny. Now put the eyes where you, where you, where it, like suits you. Uh, move each eye, move one eye over, copy and paste layer 22 to layer 23, change it black and make it smaller. Uh, do the same thing for the second eye. Now we're going to do a little sort of cartoon thing that they, that a lot of people, that a lot of cartoon makers do. They make the eye much smaller, they push it like over, over like that, and do the same for the other eye. So basically, like a little um, sort of you know, a bit of light coming into the eye. Um, now we're going to get um, a quarter circle. Make it very tiny and it's going to go with the nose. And that'll be generally it for that bit. Um, I might want to make the arm a bit more smoother, but. Um, yeah, let's make the arm a bit more better. It's another quarter circle. These are generally the tweaks now. So if you if you don't want to carry on after this, then uh, feel free just to um, leave the video here. But um, the, yeah, these are generally tweaks, and they're really good for the um, at, like, last piece of outcome of the of the main emblem. So I do recommend you do them. Apart from that. Should be turn out good actually. Um, now, for some reason, on this cartoon, it has a white bit just below the map, below the head. So we're going to get the swoop. Uh, it's going to be white. Then we're going to push it directly below the arm. Uh, that's completely below the arm. Uh, it's going to just end up being like that. No idea why it's like that, but you know. I like to go with what things say. Um, it has a few extra white bits uh, on it under its foot and everything like that, so I'll fill that all in as a small detail. And it has one under the arm. Nah, that's, that's too. That's way too thin. Uh, I think I'm gonna use a smile for that one. And uh, that's most of detail added. Okay, that's journey it for the koala. Like a little furry little fella. <laughs> um, if you like the video. Uh, please uh, rate it, uh, thumbs up in other words, 
Tesman doing a good job really. Uh, this was a um, requested video, just like most of videos. So if you've got any requests, leave them in the comment. Any ideas on what good emblems you want, leave them in the comments. It'll be very, you know, very good for me to keep doing this because it will keep up my art skills and you know it just it just generates my creations really um, so apart from that uh, yeah we've got some a lot more content in this so if you like, want to see more emblems um, please subscribe because since we've got a lot more emblems on the way we've got loads of emblems we've got an entire series on the way <laughs> um, yeah so if you want to see more videos please subscribe we've got a lot of playlists of this so please go on the playlist and you can basically see all the different types of emblems I've created um, Final Chapter and Razor have also made a few emblems themselves or just one emblem each perhaps um, apart from that I've created most of the emblems but I do guarantee they are all good uh, so if you like them yeah go and check them out uh, apart from that thanks so much for watching and I'll see you all later